but like uh, effective. I knew that it's one of these wickets that the longer you stay there, the easier it is, but it's never going to be easy because it's so slow, it's turning, it's bouncing, it's keeping low, it's so unpredictable. So that's why, uh, I don't know, I, I, even though I thought it was really ugly innings, I definitely know that 120 was a good score. Everyone kept on saying 150, no way. 120 was a good score. Now, you and uh, Wakas made that 120 possible, 115 possible, that really good fifth wicket partnership. Was there a, st a special strategy you took on after losing those um, early wickets? Uh, we were thinking more run rates rather than where to hit. Uh, we were thinking more run rates. But of course, on this wicket, we must play straight. We can't play square of the wicket. How many shots were hit square of the wicket today? None, practically. So you must play straight on this wicket, especially when it's keeping low and it's slow. So that was the only tactic to play on this wicket. And then when you went into bowl, did you uh, use those tactics? Definitely. There's no way that any of our bowlers were allowed to bowl up to the batsman. Because once you bowl up to the batsman, it's easy for them to hit through the line. But thank goodness they didn't hit over the top today. They were trying. They were struggling because they were trying to hit it over the top. This is the kind of wicket you can't do that. One shot though, which was hit over the top, was by Wakas. That uh, terrific one bounce four over extra cover. Yeah. It's one of the I think, shot, shot of the day probably Wakas. Yeah. I was just looking for him to bowl me up outside of them and I would go over because that's the only way I can hit because they were like all fillers up and like I said it's hard to hit like what Roy said so I was looking to hit on his straight and extra cover and looking was looking for improvise some shots, better sweeps, that's it. Now your coaches Charlie and Lal have been here uh, almost two weeks already. They've seen the conditions. Is there anything they told you before you went out, went into bat? Um. I think they actually didn't tell us that much. Of course they told us it was a slow wicket, but we still have to discover it as batsmen. So it took me a while, that's why I was struggling to like get some singles because the pressure was rising. But I know that somebody has to stay at the wicket and that was my role. So I fulfilled it even though there were wickets falling around me. And thank goodness Wakas came in and he batted very freely. So once he started batting freely and I could run very confident with, confidently with him, then I'm sure there was going to be a partnership which so happened. Now Wakas, you and without looking too far ahead, you and uh, you're looking likely to play Afghanistan for a semi-final spot on Wednesday yeah. to become top of the group. You and Afghanistan, Hong Kong and Afghanistan have had some great matches this year, particularly the ACC Trophy in uh, Kuwait. That was 50 overs. In 20 overs, you think you can beat them? It's cricket, it's depend on the day. Well, what's going to happen, it depend on the, the same day. Let's see who's, who's, who's willing to win the game. All depend on the same day. Yeah. Good luck. Roy Wakas Parkat, Roy Lam Sam, Hong Kong stars today. Very well played. Thanks, you too. Bye. Thank you.